What's going on, gamers and Fright Fanatics? RC Styles here, welcoming you to a four part, yes, you heard me correctly, four part Friday Night Frights this week. Wow, man, talk about getting your mutant buzz on. Coming to you high atop Indica Springs, Colorado, and I mean high. <laughs> and no authority field home of the Mile High Chronic. Just bought some of those brownies at the Get Baked sale. Man, these guys can bake up here. I can hear colors, Grim. Hey, Grim, order me one of them corned beef and hash oil sandwiches. I got the munchies something bad. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Tokyo Terminators take on the Mile High Chronic win the brain toss and can kick off or receive hey go kick off they want to kick them in the nuts right out of the gate welcome to mfl game day grim blitzrow here let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and can litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the... It's lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. And we are ready for the opening kickoff. Let's get this game underway. Perfect kick. Great way to kick off the carnage. And it's first and ten. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. Defense holds him to a four yard pick up there. Third down and six. Oh, with the brutal hit. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. game is starting to soften up the defense first down and it's first and ten do that again bricks i'll shoot you in the head but people like it well the 
little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Man, he just kicked the living shit out of that ball. Hey, Tom, I thought that after Shitgate, you couldn't inflate your balls with shit no more. Yeah, he don't care. This guy's been a shit baller since he came into the league. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? And that'll be second down and four. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Third and two. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Rainbow and he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a ball thing, Snags. He got hit by a car. And Pow with the brain scrambler. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> and chainsaws really have a way of extending the red zone on account of all that blood. <laughs> He could go all the way. The 20. He's at the 10. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. First and four. Covered your ears, Brandon snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Two points. That's a piece of art right there, Bricks. Yeah, Grim. The QB turned the defense into an abject mess. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Oh. It was a risky throw in the defense. Oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit.
which is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. And the defense spiked the offensive water with Strawberry Field. And now they can taste sound, but can't remember what the concept of time is. Sounds like new everything. Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome to Referee Rampage. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. Well, that's the end of his day. Looks like he had a bad case of the worms. First and ten. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And this guy is one of the best chip kickers in the league. And he just laid into that ball big time. Yeah, like exploding diarrhea. Remember that time in Cabo? Receivers covered. 
covered well. That's a three yard gain on that pass. Second down and seven. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completion. Six. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again. Second down and six. Quarterback just threw a quarterback passes for a touchdown. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. Second down, and he often says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And that ref is dead. Should consider hiring blind refs to make it safer for them. If they can't see the play, they can't blow the whistle. And if they don't blow the whistle, they don't die. Can't argue with that logic. Second down in a mile. with the brain scrambler. on that play. They caught the defense napping. <laughs> this one's a low pressure kick. His low pressure of a... Holy shit, a fake kick! He caught it! And nothing was going to stop him from getting Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. point but you know he they try to catch the defense napping and fake the kick and he gets into the end zone for the conversion that's his dance my floor wizard vacuum bot has better moves i dance with my vacuum a lot grim that's not wrong is it it is when you make a dinner and buy a perfume you pervert mm, only on a birthday they need a good return here to set up the offense Pacow, what a kick. That's headed for the end zone. Pacow? Yeah, just throwing some stuff at the wall to see what sticks, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Uh, 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 and he 
pulled out a chainsaw and now he's slicing and dicing. <laughs> that gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is gonna blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Oh, he is rolling thunder and pouring pain. It's a zap attack. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. Remember folks, in the NFL you are allowed to touch the quarterback just like that. And that's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's mass stupid time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his Sleeties this morning. Scrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. First down and seven. Second down in a lot. Hey guys, this isn't funny. I swear to drunk, I'm not God, but seriously, stay in. Oh, what the brutal hit! <laughs> Third down and the punter is warming up. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The Chronic is defeated today. The score says it all, but it wasn't even that close. They got blown out at home. Fans left by halftime to forget the game and start watching the new Game of Bones on NBO. You know, I watched that on my phone, too. Oh, really? Let's go down to the field and see how badly the MVP rubs it in. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the MicroHard Corporation. They get it right every other time. And all right, gamers, that brings us to the end of yet another video. So do me a favor. If you are watching on Twitch, make sure you hit that follow and the share button. It helps out more than you realize. Then I want you to head on over to our main page, which is found on YouTube. Over there, you can see all of our edited videos. Thumbs up the ones you like. Hit that like and subscribe button. Flick your ding dong so that way you don't miss out on more kick ass content from me and the Gamers Purgatory crew. And until the next video, I will be seeing you. Peace. Oh, 
Oh shit, what up? <laughs> what? 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 What?